Tonight is the opening of the UCLA Festival of uh, Preservation, which we do every two years uh, at UCLA Film and Television Archive to celebrate all of the new film and television shows that we have preserved over the past two years. The uh, Hollywood Foreign Press Association has been an important partner for UCLA Film and Television Archive. They have funded several preservation projects in the past, and we we're very happy that they were involved in, in this uh, preservation of uh, uh, this Altman film, uh, Come Back to the Five and Dine, Jimmy Dean, Jimmy Dean. That was Kathy Bates' first film, Cher's first film, the lovely Sudi Bond, who is a uh, Broadway actress, primarily, and uh, Marta Heflin, and of course, Sandy Dennis and those women. It was just it was a remarkable experience. And at the time it was remarkable, and now it's even more remarkable. So. <laughs> the condition of this film when it was found, it's supposed to be quite dirty and, and dingy, and um, they had to restore the um, color back to film and that it was all wrong. So it's been a, a, a tremendously difficult labor of love. And of course I'm thrilled because I'm so proud of my work in this, and I'm so thrilled with everyone's acting in this film, which is um, outrageously brilliant. Everyone was incredible. And Altman, of course, was at his um, absolute best, going in and just finding what was in our hearts and our souls and our thoughts and our minds and our emotions and our hurts and our pains and our secrets, moving the camera and finding all this. So it's back. We, can, we have it now. And hopefully it can be on DVD and people can experience this incredible movie. At that time, in the 70s and in the late 60s, what was happening was People were opting for real, and um, people loved real. They loved true. They loved to see the human uh, soul and heart right in front of them, whether you s sweated or vomited or your nose ran or you looked horrible. They liked to see that. And then Altman comes along, and he, he completely um, has everyone take a turn for the better. Not only do you see life really as it seems to be, which, of course, includes incredible choices. You can't do reality without really very fine choices. He suddenly has people interrupting each other in MASH. He suddenly has every, every actor mic'd separately so that if you talk over someone, you can still get all your lines, and you can behave as you behave as you'd like to behave. And this was a completely watershed uh, uh, movies and, and, um, and, and, and movement. Altman had his contentions. He had his way that he knew things should be done and what should be seen and what his gift was for us to all to have. 